The ICC Champions Trophy 2013 has not gone according to norm. Usual big tournament traditions have been reversed. Whether it be India winning all matches in the group stages or Rain helping South Africa, that too in a tied match, this has been interesting. Let's have a look at some of the instances in the tournament. In the 2011 tour of England, India went winless in a total of 10 international matches. Fast forward to 2013, they look a completely different outfit. They might still get knocked out of the semi-finals by Sri Lanka, but the performances have looked impressive. The bowling in the end overs is still a problem, but who hasn't got problems in their teams? England topped their group but had mixed shows. Their wins over Australia and New Zealand were very good, but their loss to Sri Lanka was equally poor. What they will take from this is that they beat eternal rivals Australia convincingly. This was probably the worst performance by an Australian team in a major tournament in a very long time. Pakistan were considered as dark horses in the tournament, but as everyone saw, they were by far the most unbalanced team. The biggest reverse in tradition was that Rain helped South Africa for the very first time in any tournament. As everyone knows, there are perennial chokers in cricket. Sometimes they shoot themselves in the foot and sometimes rain gods play jokes on them. This time it was the West Indies who were on the receiving end. Other reverses were that of the pitches. We all know that there would be grass and dampness in English wickets. Well, this time there isn't any as most of the wickets are dry. Early on, scores of 300 plus were being scored and one wondered, was this really England? Overall, things have not transpired as what people would have expected. That only tells us that the semi-finals and final also cannot be predicted.